Alpha Rev in the Bing Lounge. It's great to have you guys back, and this new stuff sounds so good. I wonder when you found the time to write anything. <laughs> you have been on the road, like we were talking uh, before the session began. It was this image of, you know, as far back in my rearview mirror as I can see, you've been on the road, and then the road goes on forever. With uh, how's it has it been going? This great summer, huh? Yeah, it's it, it has been great. It's um, you know, anytime a band can start playing and releasing new music it's it uh it feels like you're birthing something you know so we've been kind of reinvigorated because you can tour the same songs you know you play the same songs every night so it's been nice to to add to our set list yeah and there's something about playing live too you get that immediate audience thing you know that that yeah, creates the, gives richness to your music. Uh, I, I like the sound of where it's going. Uh, this was kind of funny. You got into Portland yesterday, and I was checking your Facebook page, and and there's a new song, another unreleased song, "You Belong." Uh, to uh, how did it go to Voodoo? Don't the Voodoo Donuts. We uh, yeah. How did that? We, how did that go? Well, we we asked our our Facebook friends what to do in Portland, and. Um, there's a lot of different things to do in Portland, but the one thing that everybody said to go do was to have donuts at Voodoo Donuts. So that's where we went, and and it was pretty magical, you know. <laughs> Sugar rush. Yeah, I mean, I, I I think that if we, I think it's one of those places you can only go so many times. Yeah, but it, there's but so this great video springs up out of nowhere. That's what you gotta love about social media right now. It's I remember seeing your face there. Mmm. <laughs> yeah, he was eating the voodoo donut. It had <laughs> red, red bl blood jelly in the middle. It was pretty, it's pretty scary, but yeah. you you loved it. Yeah. What'd you do with the rest of your day yesterday? Uh, we went down to, I guess it was Missouri, Mississippi. 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 Mm -hmm. I knew it had two S's in there somewhere. <laughs> And, uh, you know, looked at uh, all the coffee shops and, and everything here is just, there's so, so much artistic and uh, expression in this city. And being from Austin, you know, you recognize something like that. And, and this, this was my first time to kind of soak it all in. So it was really to cool. To actually have a little bit of downtime. That's got to yeah. feel good. When was the last time you saw home? Oh, well, we, you know, we try to make it home every two or three weeks. That keeps us from... You know, breaking any noses or anything. It's you got to stay healthy when you're on the road. You know. Yeah. And uh, when do you get the songwriting in? I mean, this. The, there, I know there's a lot of new stuff. Do you get to write on the road? Do you, after a show, does inspiration strike back at the bus or the hotel room? How does it work? Well, sometimes I think for a lot of bands, it's kind of you fit it in where you can. You know, for for me, a lot of these these new songs. Um, have been a culmination when you're releasing a record on a label. Sometimes you have to wait two years before you can even think about recording a new one. So a lot of this has just been breeding. You know, I know when, when we originally went to go record, I showed them a bunch of this country stuff, and they were like, no way, man. That's, that's, not, that's not why we signed you. Um, so, you know, I, I think with all artists, too, there's just there's so many, as human beings, there's so many different facets to us, you know, and, and I think to... to uh, to have to stay in one is boring. Yeah, it's like the whole world should be your playground, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah. And at the Aladdin tonight and in the Bing here, uh, Alpha Rev, great to have you back in Portland. Thanks. Mm -hmm. 